If I drive for you, you give me a time and a place, I give you a five minute window. Anything happens in that five minutes and I'm yours, no matter what. I don't sit in while you're running it down. I don't carry a gun. I drive. What do you do? I drive for movies. Is that dangerous? It's only part time. There's some guys that want me to do a job for them and I'm not gonna do it. What is that you got there? One of those men gave you that? When you get your money, his debt's paid. You never go near his family again. <gasps> Did you have any idea there'd be a second car? He said there'd be another car to hold us up. Whose money do I have? I'm gonna tell you something. Anybody finds out we're both dead. That's why this driver's got to go, Bernie. He's got to go. I know he took me out last night. It was nice, but you know he's got he's got four kids. He's divorced, and I just I just don't see that going anywhere, really. But we'll see. I don't know. He was cute. Let me call you back. Bye. Hi. Well, I see that you're here for a job interview. Welcome. Um, well, I guess let's see. So, which which job are you here for? I drive. Oh, you, um, there must be a mix-up because, um, looks like I have you down as, uh, for health inspector, but that's okay. We'll just continue on with the interview. So, why don't we, uh, just get to know each other for a little bit. Why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself. Um, what was your last job? I drive. Oh, well, that's nice. That's, that's good. Um, any, any special education or anything like that? I drive. Any, any family, kids? I drive. Okay, um, do you, um, are you okay, sir? I drive. Sir, no, um, do I need to call somebody? Are you okay? Like, seriously, like, you're kind of freaking me out. I drive, I drive, I drive, I drive. I drive. Okay, I get it. You drive, I drive, my grandma drives, my great aunt Tessa drives, second cousin twice removed drives, everybody freaking drives, all right? Can you tell me anything else besides the fact that you freaking drive? Because seriously, I'm gonna lose it. Just tell me your, just your freaking name. What is your name? I drive. Ah! Sir, um, everything okay here? I don't know what's wrong with that girl. Man, she just started freaking out crazy. I think it's that time of the month, you know what I'm saying? She just like threw up her papers and went out of there, man. Women, right? Can you feel me? <laughs> that guy knows what I'm saying. Hey guys, welcome to the IQ Review, the segment of the show where we go on Netflix streaming and we find, we go through these movies, we watch them, find the good stuff, yes. sort out the bad, so you guys don't have to. So, yes. uh, my name is Joel Valley. I'm Joan Marie Yazi Gallegos. And this week uh, is, a, is an interesting movie because it was quite popular um, a couple months back during the Oscars and everything. Yes. And uh, it's, uh, it comes yeah, to 2011. us. 2011. 2011. It's 100 minutes long. It's directed by, and I got to cheat on this because this name is crazy. It's Nicholas Winding Riffin. It's R E F N. So R E F N. I don't know what that is, but it's Riffin, Riffin. or something. So, anyway, um, you I don't know if you guys caught his uh, last movie, which was Bronson in 2008, and I simply love that movie. It's just, it's because it's so weird. It's not family appropriate. We're not reviewing that movie, so I'll just shut up. So let's go oh. into Drive. Right. Okay, Drive is the movie we're reviewing today. It has Ryan Gosling. Ooh, and it's got Ron Perlman. And then Miss Mulligan. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Um, Mulligan, it, what's her first name? And it's name? got Walter White in it. Oh, yeah, Walter White. There you go. Cranston, what's his name? Yes. Yeah, so, um, and basically it's about a stunt driver, Hollywood stunt driver, who... Has a mysterious past, because it doesn't go back that yeah. way. Yeah. 
and he gets involved in this neighbor and then her kid and then this other thing and this other thing and it goes on and, and some stuff. I really hope this happens. is not like a clue on so, what you feel about this. I don't movie. wanna I don't wanna ruin it, but let's just say he gets in a situation and situation. he's gotta drive. Because that's what he does. I drive. I drive. So I drive. What did you think about the movie Drive? I loved it. I thought it was awesome. And his jacket with a tiger. Yeah, it was a tiger. I want that jacket. And I also want to marry Ray, him, Gosling guy. Oh, my God. He's so hot. So hot in this Come back, movie. Back to the review. Oh, my God. Okay. So hot. Anyway, the movie was great. I Okay, this is, um, I wouldn't recommend for kids. It does have some adult content in it. It's a some. couple, like, some violent, <laughs> has some violent scenes in it that would be inappropriate for kids to see, especially the ending. Those are pretty, pretty gory scenes back there. Um it's a good date movie. It's a good movie to, um, you know, if you're, you know, you don't have, I mean, I, I think this is like a, it's a must see. I think it was, it was a pretty good movie. It had a really awesome soundtrack. I really like the music that was involved with it. Uh, Ryan Gosling did a really good job. It was a different part that I haven't seen him play. You know, Ryan Gosling's also known for being in The Notebook. So, you know, you can see him in his different roles that he can play. And this was really neat because he's very, he's very, um, very quiet, very mysterious in this. But I like it. The, he has some really good chemistry, I think, with the mom down the hall. It was pretty cool. So it was, it was an interesting movie. Cool twists and turns in the movie. Keep you, keep you on the edge of your seat. I liked it. Big bowl of popcorn. I liked it. Okay, so... Oh God! <laughs> no, no, no. Um, I like the movie. Um, I don't know if it was as amazing as everyone, like you know, on the internet, and everyone just loved this movie. It seemed like, and it was a good watch. Uh, but you know, I don't know. There's, I, I felt like sometimes I was just kind of like waiting for something to happen. And I think, and I think the problem is, is. Um, the trailer, and I know there's misleading trailers all the time. Every movie has them. Oh yeah. And I felt like, oh, Drive. Let's look at the trailer. Oh, cool. It's like Fast and the Furious type of deal, and it um, that way. and it wasn't. So I think I, my mind was a little bit like, oh, okay, I have to switch channels here. Yeah. This is a, like a drama movie, so don't go into it thinking you're gonna see Gone in 60 Seconds or you're gonna no. see Fast and the Furious. You know. So, but I mean, there's a story there. Ron Perlman's awesome, of course. Everyone's Ron awesome. Ron Perlman's always in awesome. This, yeah, but um, it's uh, I don't know if um, I would watch it again. I mean, it's a good one-time watch. I've seen it a couple you know, times, I, honestly. Yeah, if you want to, uh, I think you should check it Ryan. out if you like movies, because uh. yeah, uh, a lot of people like it more than I think I liked it. I'm glad you, at least pretty, you like it. It's I pretty don't popular. Feel like yeah, I never me. felt like why am I watching this, you know? But then I never yes. felt like, I'm so glad I'm watching this either. Yeah, it's not you one see? of those either. It's so it's not just like, like a... it's kind of like in the middle there for me. It was a good yeah. movie, you know? If I would have um, seen it at the theater, I don't, mm. I, you know, that's I don't know not, if that's I would That's not a theater movie for me because I, I wouldn't want to spend that kind of money on that. Like, I just liked yeah. watching it at home. It was a cool movie to watch when I was mm -hmm. there. Like, after dinner, after I was making my, my ramen. So. And then you know when there is a car scene, it's I mean it's shot well. Oh yeah. When there's um, when there's blood, it's there's blood, you know. So that I that actually, stuff was cool, but there were some times I was kind of like, let's uh, do something, you know. Yeah. Uh, I, I just guess. want something to happen. So right. that was my my little thing. But so let's start it up, huh? Drive. What do you give it? Four stars. I really liked it. I recommend it. I think it's great. Put it in your instant queue. If it was in the theaters, don't go see it there. Wait for it to come out to Netflix because it's it's a worthwhile watch there than it is in the theater because it's just it's not one of those like you need the big screen to watch it. I mean, it, it can just be like on your TV. Right. You know, it's pretty cool. Um, yeah. I'm gonna say three stars. It was just a good movie for okay. me. Okay. It was. That's it. I won't. I probably won't watch it again. I'll watch Bronson again. His other movie. Dude, we're not reviewing Bronson. Okay. Join us next week. Bye. We'll see you. Bye-bye.